আসসালামু আলাইকুম আই এম ডক্টর তানজিম রাফাত লেকচারার বসুন্ধরা আদিম মেডিকেল কলেজ টুডে উই উইল ডিসকাস অ্যাবাউট দ্য ইন্টারকোস্টাল স্পেসেস উই নো দ্যাট ইন্টারকোস্টাল স্পেস মিনস দ্য স্পেস বিটুইন দ্য অ্যাডজাস্টেন্ট টু রিপস দ্যাট মিনস আপার রিপস অ্যান্ড লোয়ার রিপস দিস স্পেস অ্যান্ড দ্য রিপস বাউন্ড দ্য থোরাসিক ক্যাভিটি ইন এ থোরাসিক কেজ সো ফার্স্ট অফ অল উই হ্যাভ টু নো দ্য হাউ মেনি ইন্টারকোস্টাল স্পেসেস এ হিউম্যান হ্যাজ উই হ্যাভ টোটাল ইলেভেন ইন্টারকোস্টাল স্পেসেস অ্যান্ড ইস স্পেস কন্টেন সাম ব্লাড ভেসেলস নার্ভস অ্যান্ড মাস্কুলার স্ট্রাকচারস আউট অফ ইলেভেন ইন্টারকোস্টাল স্পেসেস দেয়ার আর ফোর টিপিক্যাল ইন্টারকোস্টাল স্পেস ইন আওয়ার বডি থ্রি ফোর ফাইভ অ্যান্ড সিক্স ইন্টারকোস্টাল স্পেসেস আর টিপিক্যাল ইন্টারকোস্টাল স্পেসেস হোয়াই দিস ইন্টারকোস্টাল স্পেস স্পেসেস আর কল টিপিক্যাল ইন্টারকোস্টাল স্পেস দিস ইন্টারকোস্টাল স্পেসেস আর টিপিক্যাল বিকজ দিস স্পেস আর লাই ইন বিটুইন দ্য টিপিক্যাল রিপস at the boundaries of this intercostal spaces are superiorly the lower margin of the upper rib and the upper border of the lower rib which is lies below or bounded the intercostal space inferiorly and anteriorly the external border and posteriorly vertebra corresponding vertebra this intercostal uh, space have muscles vessels and nerves there are three main muscles of the intercostal space among them one is external intercostal another is internal intercostal and other is innermost intercostal muscle these muscles bound the intercostal space and their main function is with the respiration and to protect the internal organs also the external intercostal muscle that takes its origin from the lower margin of the upper rib and inserted into the lower rib also the other muscles the innermost and internal intercostal muscle they both takes from the margin of the costal group and attached with the succeeding rib and these two muscles the internal intercostal muscles and innermost intercostal muscle is also form the neurovascular plane that means the arteries vessels and nerves of the intercostal space lie in this neurovascular plane above downward the relation is vein artery and nerve and external intercostal muscle have a direction in the posterior part and the anterior part in different direction like in posterior part the external intercostal muscle is directed downward backward and laterally and in the anterior part of the body it is directed forward downward and medially and innermost and internal intercostal muscle is lie right angle to the external intercostal muscle now the artery supply of this intercostal space also with venous drainage and nerve supply intercostal spaces are supplied by the intercostal arteries in the anterior part of the body the intercostal spaces are supplied by the two arteries or two intercostal arteries and the posterior part by the one intercostal arteries in the anterior part or the anterior intercostal arteries are the branches of the internal thoracic artery exceptionally the first two intercostal arteries in case of the posterior surface of the body or the posterior part first two first posterior first two posterior intercostal arteries are the branches of the superior intercostal arteries which is the direct branch of the costo cervical trunk and costo cervical trunk is the branch of the first part of the subclavian artery 
and rest of the posterior intercostal space are supplied by the one posterior intercostal artery which directly takes their origin from the descending thoracic aorta and the anterior intercostal arteries are the branches of the internal thoracic artery up to the six intercostal space after the six intercostal space the remaining intercostal spaces are supplied by the intercostal arteries that takes its origin from the musculophrenic artery these are the artery supply in both sides of the chest wall now venous drainage the venous drainage of the intercostal spaces uh, the posterior part and anterior part also the posterior intercostal vein that is directly drained into the azygous vein except upper two which is drained into the superior intercostal vein in case of the anterior intercostal vein that is drained into the internal thoracic vein and ultimately to the brachiocephalic vein this is the venous genus of the intercostal space and the nerve supply of the intercostal space the intercostal nerve what is intercostal nerve intercostal nerve means the anterior rami of the upper 11 pair of thoracic spinal nerve is called intercostal nerve these intercostal nerves are also typical features with the similarities of typical intercostal space and this intercostal nerve has two functions sensory and motor that means intercostal nerve is a mixed nerve it carries sensation from the outer surface of the skin over the chest and also give motor supply to the muscles of the intercostal space now the clinical importance of the intercostal nerve sometimes the intercostal nerve get traumatized injury during road traffic accident or in some medical condition like infection with the herpes virus it produces painful condition of the nerve which is known as neuralgia and another clinical importance of the intercostal spaces are when a some when somebody wants to aspirate fluid from the pleural cavity or other purpose then he or she should insert the needle through the upper border of the lower rib and try to avoid always try to avoid the lower margin of the upper rib because it is closely related with the nerve fiber that means the nerve fiber of the coastal group so this is all about discussion of the intercoastal spaces in very short thank you all for your patience sharing assalamu alaikum